let's talk about warm colors, red, orange, and yellow. These are colors that make us think of warm things like the sun or a campfire, things that keep us warm. My background is cool colors, so colors like blues and purples and greens, which make us think of things that are cold, like cold water or cold green grass. You can do a warm color fish with a cool background or a cool color fish with a warm background. That part is up to you. So let's get another piece of paper so we can draw our fish outline, which is not that hard. I'm gonna go ahead on the top and I'm going to make a line that curves back, but I need to make sure I leave room for my fish tail on that side. The bottom line is gonna be the exact same. I'm just gonna curve it and try to leave it at the same spot. You can go ahead and make an eye if you want. If you wanna do a different eye, that's okay. Let's bring our tail up and down, and then we will connect those two together. And now we have a cute little fish tail. Fins at the top and the bottom are gonna be a little different. The one at the top, I'm just gonna curve up and bring it down. The one at the bottom, I'm sort of gonna make it wave a little bit, so I'm gonna curve it down and over, and then down and over and up. And that's it. Really, really simple fish. Um, when I colored it, I didn't want a hard outline on my colors. I kinda just wanted to blend them together. But I did draw my bubbles with a pencil first and then I colored around them. You could do um, lines on your fish, you could do polka dots if you wanted, you could do scales if you wanted. It's really up to you as long as you stick with warm colors or cool colors, you'll be okay. I can't wait to see what you guys come up with.